<sighs> Thank you for your patience. We'll be relaunching the Yu-Gi-Oh! 2020 Create a Card Poll on Tuesday, August 18th. With the weather versus Gradle. Join us next week and vote for your favorite theme. Hashtag Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. Hmm. 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 Let's dig on into this, shall we? Hey. Hey, weather. You guys have to overcome the menace that was, you know, Gradle again. So I want to say a couple things about this because this is a, a little bit interesting in the aspect that they're doing this. So, looks like we didn't learn our lesson the first time through. You know what that means? More voting on Twitter. Alright, downside to this. More voting on Twitter. Alright, so we've had really good memes come out of this. Uh, the, the whole colorized uh, Valkyrie Botters at the polls 2020 was a good one. But we seem to have not learned our lesson here the first time. But I do want to raise a couple of eyebrows here to this. Does that mean that the weather painter and the Gradles were botting before the Valkyrie and Insector players? Did uh, did this go unnoticed? Was it was it we, we gave too much credit to the Insectors and to the Valkyrie players. It would seem that based on them choosing to redo this means a couple things here. It means that the Gradle and the Weather Painters must have been botting before this all happened. Oh, well, that's that's not good. So, we're revving up for voting round two, Electric Boogaloo Edition. Now, please, for the sake of this, please do not use votes. Having contest to be like, hey, if Insectors win, I'm going to give out a case of the next thing. It's very clear that Konami wants social media to be involved in this. They want you to back your favorite theme. They want you to be involved in the process of this create a card system. And I respect that. It's good. It gets it's good advertising. Oh my god, yes. Konami, good job. You guys get everybody flooding on into your Twitter. You're getting all of these follows. You've got a three month long campaign going here for create a card. You did amazing for advertising. Good job, all right? Bad news is um, the TCG player base is a lot smarter than they actually look. Uh, you know, this is the same group of people that ruined your Discord. By the way, the, the Discord is working amazing for the OCG players. You don't have them throwing, you know, literal feces at each other. You know, Europe basically was able to pull off something on a smaller scale. We also had remote dueling for Gen Con be a huge success through Discord. So, smaller groups of things and even better cultured, you know, individuals are pulling this off. It's literally just, you, you look at everything from the America standpoint, we ruin everything we touch and it's glorious. So, I've never met a better group of people for this in my life. So, yes, we are redoing the voting. Uh, this is probably just a generic fallout from this. Um, they feel that, you know, just because we might not have seen bots coming out of Weather Painter and Gradle, that there might not have been some malicious intent there. And it's probably just a general reset to this, that way that they feel everything is on equal footing. So, haha, just kidding guys, we were testing it all out this entire time, we wanted to make sure that voting was going to be fair, and thank you for finding the exploit, which I'm so sorry that you spent all of this money botting up a poll that didn't even count, man. But thank you for exploiting this though, we're going to redo the entire voting process. Don't you feel like a complete and utter schmuck? 
for doing all of this, wasting your money, you know, thinking that you'd already won. Sorry, Weather Painter. As much as I, I I'm voting for you. It's, it's besides the fact here. I would love New Gradle support, but a downside to this is it's not going to happen. So, what can we infer from this? The Yukio community is a bunch of complete and utter people that will do anything to get a leg up on the other. And it's it's the best community I've ever been in. So, Tuesday, you're going to go to the votes. You're going to walk back over there to Twitter. You're going to watch somebody exploit the system again with bots because it always happens. It's people learned or... Konami's going to take something away from this. They're going to have built a page that you can go do your voting on, and we will not have to sit here and watch the voting be redone a third time. Now, I do recommend this. Uh, you know, I do seem like the kind of fat guy that's like, uh, you know, like, should you vote? Yes. Yes, you should. I think that it's a good way, it's three seconds of your life you're not getting back, but it's fun to get involved and it's absolutely hilarious to watch these Gradle players over here. The, the memes are the best thing that have come from this, alright? I'm, I'm going to continue to say that every time we look at the voting for this. The memes are the absolute best part. Uh, we had some of the best Valkyrie and Zector memes I've ever seen. Now Gradle Weather Painter had some interesting stuff along the way, don't get me wrong, but Watching, you know, the weather painter, uh, you know, boxing out and just, you know, destroying the great old monster in a fist fight was absolutely great. But get a couple seconds, go vote. Um, you know, maybe maybe don't go too crazy on it. You know, like making a Facebook post every three seconds saying, "My Yu-Gi-Oh friends, if you're not voting, I'm gonna unfriend you." Don't don't be that guy. But for the general consensus of how this is going please get involved you know for the other yugi tubers out here that people are complaining about going oh my god you know they're having a contest they're telling their viewers to go vote for this they'll give out a case i don't think that's bad i think that that's being involved he's not literally spending money over here going hey bots hey machine do targets take this ten dollars you know the clone robots are going, ooh, money. And then they're like, okay, vote. They're just, they're doing their part to get involved in this. And I do think that things like that are going to be okay with this. So, who do you think is going to win round one or round two? Uh, we'll also be seeing this weekend, by the way, we'll be seeing the rematch of Valkyrie versus Insectors. And I assure you, that it's going to be as bad as it actually looks for round two. Because trust me, somebody's going to find a way to exploit the system again. And I can't wait for the redo process. So I'll be voting for Weather Painter. I'm still going to vote for Insector. I'm sorry. Like, Insectors, as much as I hate the deck, the Link Monster was a pile of doo doo butt. You know, a vote for Insectors is a vote for good insect support. Uh, and a vote for Weather Painter is a vote for a Link 2 that they probably need. Now, I don't know what you would do with Gradle. Gradle probably needs a Link 1 at this point to be functional, let's be honest here. Uh, but the downside is you're probably not going to get that. So, cheers, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Honestly, at this point, though, I I would like to see x Sabers win this all. But I still have a feeling in the back of my mind that it's going to come down to Light Sworn ending up winning the entire voting process. For some odd ass reason, this community loves Light Sworn. There's always going to be this huge, massively dedicated fan base to Light Sworn, and I get it. But X Sabers do have a loyal following as well. And, you know, it's probably going to be Mermails and Light Sworn duking it out in the finals which you already know they're going to go vote for Light Sworn every time. So uh, the biggest mistake that you made on this poll was you allowed Light Sworn to be one of the top contenders. Otherwise, you probably would have seen Mermail versus X Sabers at least be the powerhouse round, and then whoever ended up winning that would have ended up winning the entire voting process. But am I wrong to think that Light Sworn is going to walk away the winner with this? They're going to get a brand new fancy toy that mills six cards 
you need a good card. All right, everything you got right now for Lightsworn's bad, but we'll have to wait and see. So, please, who are you voting for? Leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys think. And well, guys, Electric Blue Blue 2 Voting Edition is coming back. Peace out. Thank you, patrons, for making the ride never truly end. Without you guys' support, well, I would probably be doing trouble shuffle videos for a living. Guys, please check out Vancol 40 for all of your card fight Vanguard content brought to you by Mcol 40 And if you are looking to pick up singles, check out mcolgames.com for your trading card game needs. Thanks for watching, everybody.